Did you guys leave anything for me here? <laughs> yeah, I see some of these prices are low. Up there. Anything so far? The nice shoes court, the first house is pretty good. I found some old video games and then some action figures. What video games you Nothing special, some Xbox 360 okay. and then uh, Duke Nukem for PlayStation. Might be good, I don't know. If you watch my stuff, I don't comp anything, so I have no clue. I, know, I, I just go on a whim and then try to be pleasantly surprised. <laughs> yeah, well, like, if if I see prices like this, I would definitely comp, you know? But, yeah, that's a thing. But if they're asking like two, three bucks, I would just take them, you know? Mm. But when, when you see stuff like this, you gotta... No, I have a tough time. You have to do it. Where do you go around, usually? Uh, so, I have a friend who lives in Morristown here. Uh, okay. So me and her usually go out every Saturday, um, but if if that's not happened, I just I search community sale and then you I. Go around local, are you local to Jersey? Or no, I live local? in Delaware County, but I go where the sales are. <laughs> this is your whole pile right here? Yeah. Dang. Okay, Cle cleaned up. Nice. I'm sorry. How much is the juicer? The juicer. Oh, I think there was a price on. Um, oh, sorry about okay. Thirty bucks. Would you do twenty on it? Let me check with my sister. It's hers. Okay. Twenty bucks. You're good. Twenty five. Okay. Okay. Enjoy. Enjoy. Let me. I have a. I'll give, do you want a bag for those other ones? Yeah. No. Exactly. You sure? Okay. Thank you. The juicer. Yeah. Okay. And Thank there's you. the bag. See this bag here? You can uh -huh. put it right Perfect. in here. Perfect. I'll see you around, man. All right, man. Good luck. So what did you get? get what is going on, everybody? Uh, what day is it? It is Philly Flipper Video Day. Wow. That was corny. That was so corny, and I still said it. I don't know why. But thank you so much for clicking in and joining me on another yard sale adventure. Today, we continue down the Delran Townwide Yard Sales. This is video two of the series. If you want to see part one, you can click right here. In part one, I score hundreds and dollars worth of shoes and some really cool U.S. military memor memorabilia. Memorabilia? Memorabilia. Something like that. English isn't my first language. Uh, but if you want to click on that, if you want to check that video out, it will be right there. Today we find some more incredible items. Start off here with this Wearing Pro Juicer. So as you see, my, my boy, the guy that watches my channel, got three yards up before me, and you saw his pile is almost as tall as me, so he definitely cleaned up and he got a lot of good stuff. But I still found um, that juicer there. Wearing Pro is a brand you guys want to be on the lookout for when you are buying kitchen appliances. Usually there's Wearing and then there's Wearing Pro. Wearing Pro is worth a lot more. Usually you find them on like toaster ovens or waffle makers. Those things sell for some money. So I figured that juicer is probably worth a little bit as well, especially one that is brand new. I am currently listing it for $150. It's been up for about a month and I haven't had um, many bites in this. I think I'm gonna drop it down 10% and hoping it sells around uh, Christmas time. So I expect to sell around like the 130, 140 marks. 25 into 130 plus. I'm very happy with that profit. How are you doing? Good morning. Are you looking for any any uh, drivers? Do you have drivers? I have a whole thing in here. Okay. I didn't even put them out. Will they help my game? I can't promise that. <laughs> <laughs> this is a money back guarantee. <laughs> There's a few of them. Oh, you got you got a few. That's for sure. Hey. Anyone you want. One dollar. One dollar. Kind of hard to say no, huh? <laughs> the big horse. It's a nice name to it. What's that, that? Who's that? She dropped money in the mailbox. The girl that bought did something from us. The ponytail? Yeah. She dropped money in their mailbox. Give her, give her a call. Yeah. Oh. I'll take these three. Yeah. You guys been busy so far? Or? Not a whole lot. 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 Not a whole lot
whole lot. Yeah, it's, it's pretty much uh, after everybody leaves, somebody else shows up. That's good. It's, it's yeah. steady, right? Steady is better than busy sometimes. Yeah. 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 I actually had a big yard sale two weeks ago. Oh, really? And I just decided since it was the township. Was yeah, just to. Uh, Put it out again. There's still got a lot of stuff left here. Yeah, see if I can get rid of a bunch of more shit. Yeah, I feel you there. I want the combo. There you go. Giving you a little less to put back in, you know. That's perfectly fine. <laughs> That's the object. I like that. Cool. What do you got on a robot? Yeah, yeah get the remotes there too. Uh, Three dollars. Can't say none of that either. Uh, I owe you eleven. That was five, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There All you right. go. You have a ten. I I do. I don't. I may have money in another pocket. Oh, got got money in both pockets. That's good too. Well, the, the wallet money. <laughs> Here you go. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Yep. Good luck to you guys. All right. Thanks a lot. Hope you sell everything. Uh, I don't think I sell everything. <laughs> I'll be happy if I get rid of a lot of it. There you go. I was leaving this yard so thinking I hit a home run, but actually... <laughs> it turned out to be a dud. The DVD VCR combo that I paid $5 for would sell for about 80 to 100 but it doesn't work. The DVD part doesn't work, the VCR part doesn't work, so that became trash. The robot also didn't work, so that was also trash. The only thing that, that could sell was the remote that I sold for $15, and the golf clubs also weren't worth that much, so I'm saving them for my own yard sale. I'm going to be selling them probably for a dollar each as well. So as you guys see, this is the, the bad side of, of yard sales. Not everything works not everything is resellable that is sometimes why we offer less because there's a lot of risk that is involved when we buy things like these from yard sales so you just put money in their mailbox sometimes I don't know how it works around what? You just put money in the mailbox or something, or I don't know how it works. This stuff says free on it. Yeah. Yeah. You know, this whole thing it says free, 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 free. Yeah. And then I want to pay him for that. I don't know what to do. I just knock on the door. Uh. Are they not home? Uh, Put in the mylock? Okay, good. These in the free pile too? I don't know. Okay.
So that sale was unique to say the least. Uh, nobody was there and most of the stuff was free. I only paid $5 for everything that you see, but mainly for that Sidewinder. But to this day, I already have $87 in sales and I still have those two bags for sale that I'm selling for $9 total. So five into 177, I will definitely take that. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, summer four, summer six, summer, yeah. Uh, Joe got here first. What I miss out on? Oh, don't show me that. Don't show me that. Ah, uh, I'm gonna break my heart. Go, go that way, Joe. <laughs> you got it's GameCube? Well, yeah. It's only all Resident Evil. Resident Evil. That's a good one. Spider Man. Let me guess, you paid a dollar a game. 20 for both. That's brawl. So. Not bad. Can't complain. Not bad. Not jealous at all. Zero jealousy. Uh, yeah, yeah, I gotta get ahead of you. I thought these were Le Creuset, uh, like casserole stoneware. Those sell for some serious money. They actually a Rachel Ray, so they only sell for like 10 bucks, so I passed. <laughs> How much are the tools here? Uh, say like 25, I think. I, I can't remember. He's in the back, he'll be right back. If you're on Okay. Okay. There's 25. I'm interested. Yeah. Okay. I'm literally like, what would you get 25 for the bag? So, we need it. That is charge it. I was just, they haven't, they haven't been plugged in forever. So it's going to take a while to charge them up. That is fine. So just, that is yeah, a good deal. So I just went for about 15 minutes today. So, yeah. you want to try them all and they all work. Do you have change? Yeah. Thank you. All righty, ladies and gents, we are back at the warehouse now. Hope you enjoyed part two of the Delran Townwide sale. So let's talk about the last sale. You guys already met Joe previously in the in the first video. He was there um, pick up my scraps at the first yard sale where I got the shoes. As you see, he beat me to this one. Uh, so like this whole town white sale, there was no rhyme or reason to it. It's just a huge map and you can kind of choose wherever you go. So you'll see there's some sales I get to first or some sales he gets to first, but there was just so much stuff there that even though like I or him get him first, there's still enough leftovers for the rest of us. And he actually commented in the video that he picked up the Carhartt jacket for 25 that I passed up on. So as you see, like when I leave things behind, he grabs them in this case, he left me, uh, he left behind the tools, which I was very happy to take. Uh, for $25, this day I sold uh, one of the batteries for 20, I sold the flashlight for 10, I sold a drill by itself for 20, and I sold a jigsaw for 47, and then I sold two batteries and a charger for 40. So that's a lot of money already in sales. On top of that, I still have a uh, reciprocating saw that I'm selling for 30, a skill saw that I'm selling for 25, and then this uh, two drill battery, uh, like little bundle I made, that I'm selling for 70. Uh, there's a lot of money guys in tools, power tools especially. Porter Cable is a pretty decent brand and it's really easy to part them out because a lot of times people can have a drill but the battery dies so you need a battery. People can have a, a drill and a battery but the charger dies so they need the charger. People can have a whole set but their skill saw dies and you got to need a new skill saw so it's very easy to part these things out and they sell pretty pretty good. So $25 for that was definitely a no brainer. So if you guys aren't subscribed to Joe Affiliate Picker his link is down below go give him a subscribe and go tell him thank you for leaving the tools for paul something again another little funny joke i saw some of you guys go comment on the last video of his appreciate that that was pretty funny for me to read all right that's gonna be it for me guys uh here's my dog tasha uh peace out